Hey guys, it's Jessica and I am back with another quick and easy tutorial on how I made my shaker or glitter pins that I have been sharing with some of my craft fair idea projects. And this comes together really quickly and you really only need a few supplies. Um, so I am sharing here some shaker bits that I happen to have in my stash. Um, if you don't have shaker bits, I will post a link to some really cute ones on Amazon but you don't need shaker bits um, if you have micro beads like I'm showing here or chunky glitter or sequins, those can work too. And then I'm going to use a small funnel and then just a little embossing tray to catch all of the pieces that happen to fall out. If you don't have a funnel or a little tray like this, you can certainly just use a piece of paper. Um, just anything that will catch um, the pieces that fall and anything that will help get into that small little um, canister of the pen. So all I'm going to do is take off the end of the pen and I'm going to leave everything else intact and then put the funnel piece over top of that and then start dropping in the little pieces that I am wanting to use for this particular pen. Uh, the shaker pieces that you see here are actually from Tailored Expressions that I got in a, um, a little gift package last year. And I really wanted some teal looking uh, shaker bits for one of my projects. So I went through my stash and that is what I found. Like I said, these come together really fast. Um, the type of pen I use are the RSVP pens made by uh, Pentel. And I have actually found them at Walmart and on Amazon. And honestly, the price is pretty much the same um, either way, either, either place you get them. Um, I will leave a link to them on Amazon in the description of the video. Or like I said, you can find them at Walmart. And that is all I do. I will start tapping the pin so I can get the little pieces to move around. And uh, I call it good after that. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. And please let me know if you have any questions. And thank you so much for watching.